Hey everybody, today is Thursday, January 31st, 2013, and I am coming at you guys. This is going to be my year and a half update, even though we're kind of sort of not quite at the year and a half mark yet. Um, I just kind of, well, maybe I'll just call it like the middle update, I don't know. But I wanted to make this post um, on my last day of being a 24-year-old woman. Tomorrow I am turning 25, so I wanted to make this post. Um, just kind of to update you guys as well about what's been going on because I haven't posted in about three weeks now. So the last time I weighed in, which was Sunday, I weighed in at 283.4. I believe that's about a pound and a half or two pounds down from last week. I didn't get a chance to review the other video. I should be keeping better track of this, but I tell you, my life is a mess lately. As you can see, I've got some long, luxurious locks. Yes, this is birthday hair. This is birthday hair. So, um, <laughs> you guys know I'm a mess. Um, so let's see what else. Um, the last time I talked to you guys, I was going to be on my way to the casting in New York City. So that has came and passed. It was an awesome experience. I really, really enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. Um, I got to meet a couple of the girls that I talked to on Facebook and or Twitter that are also plus size models. So it was really cool to actually see them in person. One of them was really sweet. And I'm like, oh my God. <laughs> I was like, oh, let's have one of those. No, but she was really sweet. Um, I think like seven or eight companies took my comp card, so I haven't heard anything back yet, but I'm hoping to hear something back from them real soon, so see this camera be going out of focus, I don't know what happened, okay I'm waiting for it to get its life together. So hopefully I will hear from them sometime soon and can have some projects lined up for the spring and the summer, only God knows though, so you know, keep me in your prayers guys and wish me the best of luck. Um, what else is going on? So. Tomorrow, excuse me, Saturday, I will be going to um, New View Model Management in Cincinnati. And this is going to be my second time going there. Um, I pretty much had a call back from them. And so, well, like, the, the way the process is, is if you're still interested after, like, learning more about the company and after having an information session, you call back. And if they want you to come in, they definitely will agree to meet with you for a second time. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to meet with the owner um slash one of the i believe i can't think of the name casting directors she's one of the, she is the lady that chooses who is represented by new view and i'm really excited about new view as a company because i really think that especially in this market which is what i want to tackle first the midwest market that they can get me to where i want to be like i believe they can get me paid jobs and I believe that, you know, I can establish a presence here before I move on to bigger markets. So I'm hoping everything works out with that and that's going to be tomorrow. So what I have to do is I had to memorize a commercial. So it was a Volkswagen Golf commercial. I had to memorize the commercial and I'll be reciting that to them. So um, I'm still trying to, I'm in the process of memorizing all that right now. And so on Saturday, I will be driving up to Cincinnati and meeting with them again and hopefully signing some papers. So I'm hoping the next time I talk to you guys, I will officially be an agency signed model, but we shall see. Um, what else is going on? So um, tomorrow on my birthday, I'm going to take my first kickboxing class. I bought a Groupon. I was a little overzealous, but I don't care. I bought a Groupon for 20 kickboxing classes, which I am so excited about. Like this is like, you know, punching the heavy bag. Like it's going to be crazy cardio. It's an hour long class and I'm just, I'm way too excited about it. So I can't wait to do that. Um, also, um, in Poopy News and Liam News, um, he's going to be starting speech therapy coming this Monday, which I'm ecstatic about and I'm so happy he's finally going to be able to do it. The bad news is that even though he's starting the speech therapy, it's now like it's at the same time that my Monday, Wednesday Get Fit Club at the YMCA is. So I'm going to be missing every Monday for the rest of my session. And I think that's going to be like eight weeks of Mondays, which sucks. So I'm going to have to find another way to get um, to get a workout in on Mondays. And I don't know really how that's going to be possible because it's going to be a tight schedule. His therapy, I'm going to have to go to class in the morning. So I'll drop him off at daycare, go to class, come back to pick him up for therapy, um, take him to therapy, wait there, bring him back to daycare, then go to work. So it's going to be a lot of running around. So hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to figure that out because I need to get these five times a week working in, um, working out in. Um, so another thing, I dropped the couch to 5k class. It was just too early and I needed like the time on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Like sometimes I have errands to run. Today's a Thursday. See, I'm making this video. If I had the couch to 5k, wouldn't be able to do it. So I dropped that class. I didn't really feel that I needed it. Like I run on my own. I run on the treadmill. And, you know, I was just, I'm going to focus on that. And I know that 
I'll be able to run a 5k this spring, so I'm focusing on that. Um, but I still am taking Pilates. Pilates is an awesome class. I feel myself getting better with every class. Like, I seriously, after the first class, my flexibility has improved already. So now I've got to work on je posture, because my posture is terrible. So, um, you know, it's great. Um, what else? Um, pretty much, I think I mentioned this in the last video, but, um, even though I am still on my weight loss journey, originally I said I wanted to lose 108 pounds, but I am scaling that back, because right now I'm a size 20, I'll show you guys, I'm wearing a dress today, it's belted, this is beautiful, I love this dress, it's ASOS Curve, love this dress, so if you can still see me back here, this is me at a size 20, and I'm 5'8", and you guys know how much I weigh, I weigh 283 pounds. And the funny thing about it is back when I was pregnant with Liam and like right before I was pregnant with Liam, I was probably the same size but about 30 pounds less. So I think like that's crazy stuff. So I think for right now, my short term goal um, by the summer, like June, is to be like 250. And if at 250, I'm closer to a size 16, I might try to scale it down and try to lose like maybe another 10 or 15 pounds to get me to a size 16. But um, at this point, I'm more about measurements and I'm more about size. Cause you guys know as a plus size model, like I'm gonna have to maintain a regular size. And for me, I think my body would be comfortable at a 16, 18, but 18s are hard to um like it's hard to get jobs as an 18 especially because i'm only 5 8 normally if i'm 18 and i was you know a size 18 and i was 5 10 it would work a little better but i think us being a 16 at 5 8 is going to be a lot more beneficial for me and my career so um like i said but again that's the size i believe i will feel the most comfortable so i'm ready for that um what else is going on there's really nothing else going on i'm just you know i'm happy i'm living life I'm gonna be 25 tomorrow, I can't believe it, a quarter century. Not that that's old, it's just like, it's crazy. I, You know, when you're like 13, 14, 15, you don't even think as far as 25, so I was just excited to get to 18 and 21. Now that I'm gonna be 25, it's pretty crazy. Um, but you know, everything else is good. Um, me and mom and Liam are gonna be going to Atlanta next weekend for the Full Figured Fashion Week casting. Ah. And soon you guys are gonna see a video that I'm posting, it's gonna be the face, the face, Cicely Carter, the face of Full Figured Fashion Week 2013. Hopefully, hopefully that's what you guys will see. So if you remember my video from last year, I did post um, a video where I submitted to be the face. So hopefully this time they see all of this <laughs> and they will pick me and you know, I'll be on my way to New York in June. So I thank you guys again for listening. Um, you know, I'm just really excited just to be living better, to be living healthier. And I thank you guys so much for following me. And I hope that you guys are doing well out there on your journeys as well. And that, um, you know, that you're just taking it one day at a time. Don't beat yourself up. It has been 18 months and I've only lost like 45 pounds. So like, don't feel that, you know, I mean, to me, that's like, Oh, too little but you know I know people who in 18 months have lost like a hundred pounds but you know everybody's journey is their own and you have to just do what works for you and your body and for me I was meant to be plus size and I've accepted that but I you know I'm not gonna go around I'm not gonna just laze around and not work out I'm gonna be curvy sexy fit I am gonna be a powerhouse a curvy goddess as my friend Diane would say so um, I just encourage you guys male and female take care of your bodies this is the only body that we have so take care of it while you can do what you can when you can and I will talk to you guys next time have a good day bye